Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm the Gerbil, and in this video I'm going to show you how to complete the June 3rd Galactic Challenge Lothal Empire in one battle, and it's all about rebels. It really is. So the uh, the global modifier here says at the start of a support player's turn, it's going to inflict target lock on a random ally. Keep that in mind. And then it says whenever a ship has four or more buffs, they're going to be inflicted with breach and exposed to debuffs. Now, why is this all about rebels? Well, first off, uh, Biggs is going to recover protection and he's going to taunt whenever anybody gets hit with target lock. So that's going to trigger him automatically. Hans Millennium Falcon is going to cleanse off those debuffs automatically because that's two. Uh, whenever you get a third, he'll be cleansed. And also the global modifier basically says that there's a 50% additional chance for assists, which is how Home 1 re regenerates bonus protection on all of your allies. Now, the feats are really easy. Obviously, winning is all you have to do for one of them. Another one says get 15 critical hits. If you're running Rebels, you're going to be assisting nonstop. That's going to be super easy. One says have a light side, dark side, survive the battle, and that's going to happen automatically when you throw in three droids. Interestingly, there are only three droids, and they do not have to be on the starting lineup. They, In fact, you don't even need to use them, as you're about to see here just how easy this is. Now my rebels are all awesome. I mean like Cassian and Jin, they're they're relic six, seven, but you really don't have to be that high. The probably the biggest trouble is just keeping uh, Biggs alive right there. And I had a little luck. He got down into the red, but this was my one and only attempt. I, I did not play this more than one attempt and we're gonna win. So Already, we have recovered Biggs' full protection and he has bonus protection, and we just saw a passive cleanse from Hans Millennium Falcon, so he's perpetually getting hit with stuff. Now, he did finally go down, but that's okay. He survived long enough for us to do enough damage to drop the TIE Bomber. Now, notice all the assists we're getting there, so you definitely need to start with Biston, uh, Biggs, and Hans Millennium Falcon. I mean, that is the de facto lineup i know i see a lot of people throwing in y-wing um no that is actually no no sorry i am a rebel pro here and i'm not trying to like pat myself on the back but um i was beating executor and still am periodically beating executors with rebels long before it was like an acknowledged thing um, i probably have the de facto rebel strategy guide out there i'll link it in the description below check it out it's super super detailed um, but notice, again, all of the assists are guaranteeing all the crits. Cassian is going to provide um, critical chance up. Hans Millennium Falcon is going to crit almost anyway. I mean, this was, this was easy. This was, um, thankfully, CG threw us an easy one. Now, I'm not saying everyone will experience the same ease. Your mileage may vary, but hopefully this helped. All right, good luck out there. I will see you on the hollow tables. Take care, people. Bye-bye.